You want to know where God justified sinners? It was at the cross. Not when you see it, no. If he causes you to see it, it's because you were justified there at the cross. Everything about Christ's death is significant and important here, even as this brazen altar was significant and important. The acacia wood pointing to his sinless humanity. The wood being covered with brass was that it might endure the fire. If Christ was a mere man, he could not have endured. But he was a God-man and therefore endured the fire of God's wrath. And that's what the brass represents. It's the very wrath of God against sin. That's what this whole altar is about. There's no other way of satisfaction. And so the cross, there's no other way of satisfaction than what Christ endured there at the cross. It says that when they took up stones to stone in verse 32, Jesus answered them. Do we really need any other witness than Christ himself as to who he says he is? Isn't that what it is to believe on Christ? Is to believe his word? Is to believe how he has manifest himself through his word? He says to them, many good works have I showed you from my father. What he's declaring there is his work on this earth in coming was for the glory of the Father. He didn't come down here to try to gather a crowd or be popular. He wasn't up for election. That's how he's presented today, as if he's running for office. He wants to be the king of your life. Won't you please let him in? That's not the Christ of Scripture. But when he says, many good works have I showed you from my Father, what's a good work? It's that which is produced by Christ himself to the glory and honor of the Father. That's the simple definition here. And so the good works, you might say, well, that's his miracles that he did, yes. He didn't just go around doing miracles just to do miracles. Every miracle had a purpose, according to what we read here, that it was from his Father. It was that men might know these works that he did, might know that he was indeed that Messiah, that anointed one. That's what the word Messiah means, that sent one of the Father. 